Welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today's lesson is about volume of a cylinder and the substrate is the application of the formula to get the unknowns. Let us work mathematical problems with the unknowns that demands us to apply the formula to come up with the unknown. In this question, we are told that the, the radius of a cylinder is 14 centimeters and its volume is 4,312 centimeters cubed. What is the height? We're supposed to come up with the height of the cylinder. Therefore, for us to get the height, we need to apply the formula. And the formula for getting volume of a cylinder, because already are given the volume, is cross-sectional area times height. This can also be the area of the base. times the height. In a cylinder, the base is a circle. Therefore, pi r squared times h. Once we apply this formula, we'll be able to get our known, which is the height. Now we replace whatever we are given in the equation or in the formula. 4,312 is equal to 22 over 7 being our pi times r and our r, remember we are given the diameter to change the diameter into radius we divide the diameter by 2 so 14 divided by 2 is 7 so times 7 times 7 multiplied by h that we don't know to give us this volume therefore now we cross multiply 22 times 7 it's 154 so all this is 154 h should it give us a volume of 4312 we want h we divide both sides by 154 by 154 or oh, by 2, it's 77. By 2, it's 2. By 2, it's 1. And then remainder 1, which is 5. Because of 10. Remainder 1 again, you put it here, you stop. Divided by 2, it's 6. By 7, it's 11. By 7, here, it's 3. Because of 21, you put a 0, because you can't drop two digits. Which is 6 divided by 7, it's 8. By 11, 1. By 11, 2 because of 22 remainder. 8. 88 divided by 11 is 8. And the answer is 28 centimeters. Therefore, our height is the height of 28 centimeters. Let's do our next example. In our second example, we are told that a cylinder has a radius of 28 centimeters. If the cylinder contains 27,104 centimeters cubed of water. How deep is the water? So this is a cylinder and the radius is 28 centimeters. We don't know how deep it is. Deep depth talks about the height. So you're supposed to look for the height. But the volume is already given as 27,104 centimeters cubed. Therefore, in this question, we are supposed to apply the formula to come up with the unknown. And the formula of getting volume of a cylinder is equal to pi r squared h. H is the height. So, we replace whatever we are given in the equation in the formula. So, multiply by our r, and our r is 28 times 28. Multiply by h that we don't know to give us a volume of 27,104 centimeters cubed. So by 7 is 1, by 7 it's 4. 4 times 22 is 88, times 28, 64, carry 6, 64 plus 6 is 70, 16, 16, 17, 4, 6, 14, 2. Therefore, this times h, 2464, H is equal to 27,104. We want our H. Using algebra, we divide, we divide both sides by 24, 64, 24, 64. And we remain with our H here. So let's divide by 2. It's 1, 2, 3, 2. By 2, 1, 3, 5, 5, 2. By 2, it's 6, 1, 
6 by 2, uh, 6 because of 12, 7 because of 14, 7 because of 14, and 6 because of 12. By 2, 3, 0, 8. By 2, 3, 3 because of 6, 8 because of 16, and 8 because of 16. So we can continue our division here. 3 divided by 308 by 2, 1, 1 because of 2, 5 because of 10, and 4 by 2, 1 because of 2, and that remaining one you put it here, 6 because of 12, we remain with the one you put it here, 9, 9 because of 18, and 4. By 2, 7, 7. By 2, 8, 4 because of 8 and 7. By 7, 11. By 7, 1. Because of 7, that one remains here. 14 divided by 7, 2. 7 divided by 7, it's 1. By 11, 1. By 11, 1 because of 11. Remain another one here. 1 because of 11. And our answer, our H is equals to 11 centimeters. Let's solve our next example. In that example, we are told that a cylinder has a volume of 550 centimeters cubed. If the height of the cylinder is 7 centimeters, what is the diameter? Now, we know that when you're getting volume, you don't have anything like diameter in the formula. But we know that the moment we get the radius, we can now get our diameter. To get the radius, we need to apply, apply the formula of getting volume of a cylinder. And volume of a cylinder is equal to pi r squared height. Therefore, our volume already is 550. The pi is 22 over 7. Our r Square that we don't know, multiply by our h, and our h is 7. So this 7 goes at 7. 550 is equal to 22 r squared. We want r, not 22. So we do away with 22 by dividing on both sides. By 11, 2. By 11, 50. By 2, 1. By 2, 25. Therefore, 25 is equal to r squared. We want the radius, but not radius squared. So what do we do for us to get the radius? We get square root on both sides. Remember this r squared? Initially, it was r. What happened for it to be, to, to be squared? We multiplied r times r. So to go back, we get the square root of this. So we do, whatever you do on our right, we also do it on our left. So square root of 25 is 5. Square of r is square of r squared is r, and therefore our r is five. So our radius is five, but the question we are being asked about the diameter. Diameter. If you draw a circle, diameter is this line. A half of it makes a radius. So these two radius here will make a diameter. So to change the radius into diameter, we multiply by two. And our diameter is 10 centimeters. I wish you the best and kindly subscribe, press the notification bell, and also share with your friends. Also leave a comment. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.